Good afternoon, or good morning. This is Santa, and I am here today for a very special reading with Lola. We're going to read her book, I Am Lola, and she's going to read it to us today. And here she comes. Hi, Lola. Are you happy here to be here to read today? You want to read your book? Come on up. This is Lola. Oops. Chapter one, I am hopeful. When I was young, my home was in a backyard. It was a nice yard, but I did not have a lot of interesting things to do. Eventually, I moved to a barn and I became a mother. My home, Mimi and I had each other, but there was still something missing. Horses love purpose. We want to have things to do that make us feel helpful and needed and connected. When we do, our physical and mental health is better and we are nicer to be around. Horses like routine. We want to know what we are going to do with our humans. I didn't have a feeling of purpose or a positive routine. One day, a very nice woman saw me and me and took us to live with her mini, Johnny. The woman took good care of us and was kind and loving. It was wonderful having a new home and a new friend, but I still wanted something more. When Mimi was old enough to eat hay and grass, I hoped it would be time for me to find my purpose. I was thrilled when it happened. A lady who was part of a therapy horse troop came to meet me. She thought I could join them. A therapy troop is a group of horses and humans who visit schools, care facilities, and events to help others. The horses and humans are specially trained. It's a lot of work. I said goodbye to Mimi. That was sad, but I knew she had her friend Johnny and a very good place to live. Now I began my big adventure. Would I like my new home? I hoped so. Would I make a friend? I hoped so. My new home is perfect for me. I have a mini friend and many interesting things to do. I always hoped for the right home and the right purpose. Sometimes I felt sad and worried that it would never happen. When you feel that way, finding hope can be hard. You might feel stuck and unsure about how things will ever change. Remind yourself that hope is a choice. Even when things look bad, you can choose to have hope. That's what I did. I kept hoping. I am Lola. I am hopeful. Oh, Lola, it's snowing. Oh, it's such a beautiful book. And thank you for coming today. I know you want to eat the snow and have fun with it. So I'm going to let you go and enjoy your day, okay? Thank you for reading your book to me today.